Hello, little explorers. Today we're going on an incredible journey back in time to the world of the dinosaurs. Our dinosaur of the day is the Ineosaurus. Can you say that with me? Ineosaurus. Good job. Now, let's imagine how big an Ineosaurus was. Picture a car, it was almost as long as two cars end to end. That's about 15 feet long. Wow, that's big. But, it wasn't very tall, only about 6 feet. That's a little taller than your dad. Now, let's talk about weight. Imagine five refrigerators stacked together. That's about how heavy an Ineosaurus could be. That's about 1,000 kilograms. That's a lot of dinosaur. What did Ineosaurus like to eat, you ask? Ineosaurus was a herbivore, which means it only ate plants. It didn't have sharp teeth to eat meat. Instead, it had flat, grinding teeth perfect for munching on leaves and ferns. The Ineosaurus lived a long, long time ago, in a period called the Late Cretaceous. This was around 74 million years ago. Can you imagine that? When dinosaurs roamed the earth, and there were no buildings or cars, only nature. Ineosaurus is part of a big dinosaur family called the Ceratopsians. They were known for their interesting features, like horns and frills. Ineosaurus had a special curved horn on its nose, like a can opener. Now, where was the first Ineosaurus found? In a place called Montana, in the United States. Paleontologists, those are scientists who study dinosaurs, found the first Ineosaurus fossils there. Fossils are like dinosaur bones turned to stone that help us learn about these fascinating creatures. So, what have we learned today? The Ineosaurus was a big, plant-eating dinosaur that lived millions of years ago. It had a unique curved horn and was part of the Ceratopsian family. And the first Ineosaurus was discovered in Montana, USA. Isn't it amazing to learn about these incredible creatures that once roamed our Earth? Next time you see a car or a refrigerator, remember the Ineosaurus and just how big it was. And, when you eat your veggies, remember, you're eating just like an Ineosaurus. So, keep exploring, and keep learning.